What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video and in today's video We're pretty much gonna be working on the 7 series again the last video you guys knew the news with the M4 um, So more updates to come obviously with that hopefully I'll be showing you guys the home pretty pretty soon We're finally getting situated on that so for those of you guys who are waiting for an update on the house That's gonna be very very in the near future um, But as for now we're gonna get back to work on the 7 series because I really want to knock out the fenders and the hood and today And then probably the side skirts um, in about a day or two or try to get it all in this video but I want to be able to knock out everything but the front bumper the front bumper is gonna to have to be a whole video in itself Because once you have to take it off we have to replace um, the air temperature sensor We got to put in the fog lights. We got to put in the side markers We're gonna to have to wrap the whole bumper we're gonna to have to sand the whole bumper It's a whole process and the bumper alone wrapping it takes about six hours from my personal like from my personal experience Because I suck at doing bumpers so it takes a very 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 long time We did get the grills as well the two giant grills in the front so It's really gonna complete the car so hopefully once we put all that together even the fog lights will even be knocking out airs at the same time as for the climate control situation We're, we're probably gonna try to see if we can test it in this video um, to see if the if it, the climate control is getting any power at all Some of you guys are saying it's a battery issue Some of you guys are saying that it could be another module that's failing uh, the module that actually controls the climate control module So we'll have to die. We'll get into all that hopefully pretty soon But as for now, we're gonna be focusing on wrapping the front end I want to get those fenders and that hood knocked out. So let's go ahead set you guys up start working on that All right guys, so we just finished this fender and it honestly came out really, really, really good. So the fender actually has like two little like damage things there. That's not the wrap, that's the actual fender. Um, again, when I actually sanded this fender down right here, I found out that there's actually Bondo. So uh, there's a little bit of like a Bondo marks as you can guys can see, it's not perfect. Uh, but I mean it's a lot better than it was and we actually hammered it in so now it's flat It's actually perfect there uh, rest of the fender is absolutely perfect all the way around all the cuts everything came out really 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 good uh, We ended up painting the center turn light uh, just to kind of give it a little bit of a tint effect We're just gonna put one coat on there one heavy coat and that's it and then we're gonna wrap around it to match this So I think it's gonna look super 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 sick There's not much aftermarket parts for this car So we're kind of just going and doing things at our own, you know our own style So I hope it comes out good this side skirt is gloss black. It doesn't look bad have, but I do want it to match so don't worry we'll end up wrapping this as well I keep forgetting this is even there because it's barely that noticeable, but we're gonna go ahead and get it done anyways But yeah, <laughs> it's really coming together. Let's go ahead and work on the other side
bada bing bada bang guys so we just finished the hood both fenders this looks so much better it literally looks like it got a fresh new paint job um so all this is finally matching other than the front bumper obviously and the wheels are just hideous all the inner stuff is super muddy so we're gonna have to actually clean all that clean off the tire some tire shine repaint the wheels but I, i'm like th guys this car is really coming together i cannot wait to also paint match I mean, not paint match, also to wrap this little piece right here. We're about to do this right now. Let's go ahead and knock those things out and then uh, pretty much ready to go for today and then hopefully tomorrow in the same video though, we'll do the side skirts and uh, touch up anything else this car needs other than the front bumper because that is gonna need a whole dedicated video on its own. So uh, this is officially like a couple days later. Uh, we are in the car right now in the 7 Series. And again, this this video and the last video is kind of like intricated, like, like they're one in the other. So if you see some parts wrapped in the other video, you know it's because of this video, vice versa. Um, Any hill, uh, we are heading down right now to finish up the rest of the car. So we need to get uh, more of the quick detailer spray to make sure we can get all the contaminants off of the side skirts before we go ahead and wrap them. So uh, we wanna make sure we do it properly. Let's head down to Walmart and just get that bottle real quick. I think that bottle's like $8, but well worth the money. Need this for the house? Might as well get it. Eight dollars? Can't say no to that. So now that we have the car in the shop, again, shout out to Showman Motors for getting all the work done on this car. Huge shout out to them, they absolutely killed it. Now that even the car drives so much better, so much smoother, no leaks, it literally makes this car feel a whole lot better. We are just now trying to just perfect the car, which we're gonna be wrapping all these trim pieces, clean up the windows, polish out the roof. Uh, again, just pretty much just, just get rid of all this disgusting stuff. We need the car to be absolutely perfect. Um, even the dash, the alignment, the center console, we're gonna get all that sorted. The wheels, we're gonna go ahead and sand them down, paint them, polish the tires. I want this car to look absolutely mint at the end of the day. So the next thing is, even though you can't really tell this side skirt really needs to be wrapped from this angle, we're still gonna go ahead and wrap it. So the first things first, we're gonna have to actually clay bar it, clean it up the same way we cleaned up the doors and everything. So let's set you guys down and just start cleaning this side skirt up. Uh, I might disconnect the battery as well so we don't kill the battery in the car, but uh, uh, we'll, we'll see about that. Let's just go ahead and just start cleaning this side skirt. guys so we just got both side skirts on there it looks so good actually th this side skirt has some serious damage to it where is it where is it right there this isn't my wrap work this is like a huge gouge like he went over a curb or something but anyway as for the wrap work itself i think we did an absolute good job here if you open up the door we have that first line in looking pretty clean all the way across so really happy about that also the car is black so it just looks it just blends really nicely but anyhow now we have pretty much the entire car fully wrapped up hopefully we're going to be working on these things pretty soon the windows i want to get all that like the, the the water spots whatever it is i'm gonna go ahead and actually this is actually go ahead and practice on the driver's window real quick right now before we actually end the video because I actually want to see how it look. Obviously we have the front bumper we still need to complete on this car. That will take one day in itself. I told you guys there's so much to do for that front bumper. Um, you guys will see it's going to be an absolute mess but hopefully we'll take care of it and knock it out in one video. Um, but as for this window, let's go ahead and roll it up and see if we can clean up all of that disgusting stuff, all that water residue and hopefully it should look pretty good. So I don't know if you guys can see all those water stains on the window there. All of that. So this is the before Let's hopefully knock out this entire window, get all of that knocked off. Like it will not come off with water. So let's go ahead and try it with uh, this little dude right here. A little, little technique I learned from the showmans.
And this is the after, guys. Like, look at the difference. That is absolutely stunning. And as well as the mirror, it literally looks stunning. Now, this car feels like a million bucks just because all the windows are clean. I haven't knocked out these rear ones yet or this one or the other side. We'll do that hopefully in the next video uh, with, you know, the front end, of course. And at the same time, we're gonna hopefully try to knock out these guys and probably these little pillars right here. I wanna knock out as much things as possible. I want this whole car to hopefully be done in the next episode. So in the next episode, guys, I, I'm not gonna promise, but I'm gonna hope I have the rest of the car all complete other than the wheels. And then obviously we'll take out, we'll knock out the wheels uh, in a separate video as well. Make this car fully murdered out. I'm super excited for this. We are looking for some new builds on the channel. I'm actually trying to get two new builds. One that's not even a BMW, but it's not a car either. So a new build on that aspect. And then another build on the channel. It's gonna be another BMW. And at the same time, we're still gonna be working on this car as well. Uh, so we're bidding on those other two cars. I'll let you guys know when we get actually those two other cars onto the channel. Very, very, very exciting stuff. As for the seven series is really coming together. I really want to knock out all the maintenance and all the leaks and all that stuff because I do want to do an oil change um, pretty soon and uh, you know that drain plug was really really beat up so I didn't even want to drain the oil again so we had to make sure we get the maintenance done. Now that we got all that done, now that the car is looking really 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 good. This car is going to finally get the life that it deserves. Without further ado guys, if you guys have a cop some merch, make sure to cop some merch down below. I'm pretty much wrapping up the plaque for the 7 series. The M4 plaque is pretty much sealed up. I'm going to be showing the two plaques hopefully in the near future as well and I'm also going to be announcing the M4 winner uh, for the, the, the carbon fiber strut race, the destroyed one that came from the M4. So that's also going to be in the giveaway to one of you guys that already entered for the M4 thing. So that's already in the past. So for those of you guys who all entered, uh, just stay tuned. And for those of you guys who haven't entered to be on the, M the, the 740 Li plaque, make sure to cop some merch down below. Without further ado, guys, I love you all so much. Remember to stay humble. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.